Hey guys, what's up? Jack here. Welcome back to some more Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. We're gonna go ahead and look at our party. We have our Leviathan, our level 27 Gyarados. Dan, our level 27 Butterfree. Kimberly Puff, our level 28 Wigglytuff. Ken, our level 31 Vileplume. Zippo, our level 25 Charmeleon. Amaterasu, our level 30 Pidgeotto. And we're gonna go ahead and rock with... Uh, Let's see. Let's have Vigglytuff follow us today. Cool. Question of the day is, what is your favorite Mega Store in Pokemon? So, Mega Stores isn't like, you got Celadon City is one, I think one of the games has like a shopping mall. Um, basically the big areas, like, I think Alola has the big market stalls on like the beach. You got like uh, Scarlet and Violet has the big like pier area where they do all of the auctions. I'd count that or I'd count where the actual Kahuna that does the auctions is. Not the Kahuna but whatever the gym leader. Um, where you have to bring him his wallet. There's just a bunch of stores there. Sword and Shield I think it's just like one of the major cities. Let me know what your uh, what your favorite like mega store is. I like the auction house because you can get a bunch of stuff, but a lot of it's really high price. And I think Celadon City is probably my favorite because I know every time I go to Celadon, uh, we have evolution stones. And I always found like in other games those would be like rare. But you all you can always count on it in Kanto. It's called. And like, yep, let's go ahead and switch Pokemon. Let's actually bring out uh, Quickly Tough. It might be a bad switch, actually. But... You dig. Oh, he avoided it. Brick break. See if we can finish him off with a headbutt. something cool to pop up. I think everything I saw last episode at the end of it in that grass was just things we have. I don't know if we have Eradicate, but we have a Rattata. Super Nerd Aiden. Alright, you're sitting out coughing. Sucks, but we'll use Dan. Go ahead and side you, I guess. I don't want to run back and heal already.
You know I want Gyarados to have XP. Down to the Rocker Glen. Got a Jolteon. That's good, I didn't have no Gyarados. Oh, but Pidgeotto's gonna be dead. Eh. Pidgeotto might die, we'll just go with the ring attack. I used agility, you could have just like one shot me probably. The agility doesn't matter if you just keep raising your speed, I'm just gonna click attack. Doesn't mean you can one shot me like why do you double kick? You're not having an electric type move? You're a Jolteon, dude. Go get go buy Thunder. What are you doing? You could probably just one shot the Pidgeotto with Thunder. It's in Celadon. Ooh, Dragon Rage. Yeah, let's see where to scratch is because. I think Zippo evolves are like what? It's either 20, 32 to 36. I think the starters evolve. Another one hit KO guy. Let's see if Raticate pops up. Just to see if we actually have him. It's a Growlithe. Popped up the Growlithe. Now let's just fight this one KO guy. They're not popping up. Gamer Stan. Rhyhorn. Okay, so you got another horn, horn drill probably. Going attack. Ah, oh, you hit Hondro anyway. Okay, well, we weren't going to do anything to that. Do Kimberly Puff. It doesn't really matter if you hit the one hit KO. Plus, we'll dig. So that'll use up some of its uh, timing as long as I'm faster. Yeah. So he's going to waste one now. And the other one has like five. That would be two years. Three. We'll dig again. So this will be f number four. Go. Yeah. This will be number five. And we have rooted it. We'll go dig again. He has no moves left, so he struggled. He has no moves, so you struggle. Oh, he would have died if we would have been above ground. Um, he couldn't struggle because we weren't on the field. I didn't know that's how that worked. I thought you just struggle anyway. But you can't do anything. I, mean, I guess you can only struggle if the opponent's actually on the ground. On the field. Let's grab this uh, Pokeball. Now we don't have T, right? We never got that yet. I probably can't go left. So cute. Meow, meow, meow. Yeah, meow. Lost Andrea. Yep, you got meow. 
Hmm. Nice brick break. Oh, he just destroyed the cat. Alright, so that's one of your lives down. Gonna use your second one now. Brick break again. Ah, uh, yeah. Just like fake out, like get a protector or something. Forty one hundred to seventy five ninety five. It's less accurate, but we'll get it. It would be much better on like an actual Butterfree with abilities, but it still works out. I think the power is worth it. Because it's more than double. So as long as you're not missing like two in a row, it's kind of makes itself worth it. Got like fuzz, fuzz on me in a blanket. Mm. It sucks that there's no double battles except like Jesse and James. Just let me fight these two together. Oh, you got a Pikachu. Too bad this, you don't have a light ball. Oh, P Pikachu is like buffed in this game. Let's break break. Karate chop Pikachu. Oh, break break's gonna break that. Yep. I forgot that's how that works though too. That brick brick just breaks barriers. Okay, what does this guy want? School is one, but so are Pokemon. I kind of agree. Nerd list. But most of the time, school is where you have Pokemon. At least growing up, that's where like everybody had Pokemon growing up. Is you'd see them at school. they tell you like what they caught now their uncle works at Nintendo and now they have a Mew behind a truck so you found out all that stuff where they talk about like the creepy bosses of like the Pokemon like hymno version or whatever On guard duty. I take it very seriously. Hold on, kid. I'm I can't pass you through. Alright, that's because we can't go to that city yet. We gotta skip over to Celadon. See, Pokemon kind of trouble with Celadon City. I forgot there was more than one Lapras or er, Snorlax. I was just thinking of like the one. All right, we got fresh water. That's pretty good. Pretty wing. I'm just smashing the A button as I'm running. Do you, all, do you go often? Oh, you know what I mean. To the department store and sell it on the city? It's all kinds of things. It's very handy. We can get some evolutions going. Just to help with the Pokedex. Now this person's gonna fight me.
I mean, gym badge is deep. I forgot that you can get Squirtle up by Bill's house. Like a wild one, and it's like a low percentage chance. I'm gonna remember if you're like Nuzlocke this game or something. Let's dig. Tough it out, Charmeleon. Right, she's probably faster than really tough. Big anyway. Yep. Butterfree's Butterfree's dead if I send Butterfree. I guess we gotta use Ken. I want to kill Dan immediately. Let's sleep out her. had a higher accuracy though. I guess not. I'll keep battling. We don't need Doug Trio. back. He does have like a unique team though. Del Trio and Raichu. So it's not the same thing over and over again. But we'll see what the last Pokemon is. Like an inner email or something? A seal. Ooh. Awesome. And we might be able to get back to full. Oh, he's faster. Oh, okay. I thought that was going to do more than that. I'm just trying to make it to the apartment store guy. Can't remember, is Seal a regular evolution or is he a, like a water stone evolution? I never see Seal. And I think the point is like, you get so far in the game, like why would you use Seal? Like he's at what, like the Seafoam Islands? By then you have a Squirtle if you're playing like Yellow version or Let's Go. Or you have a Magic Card. Like you have so many different things. Okay, let's... Let's heal and then run back. But I want to actually have my team ready. Thanks for waiting. Your Pokemon should be all better now. 
The woman with the abra at the corner over there. Rumor has it she's an amazing fortune teller. Here, collect a lot of Cantonian sand shrew. If you have a sand shrew, please trade it. I do. Here's a level 4 one, dude. I think this is also an ice stone evolution. If I'm not mistaken. But is it still like exclusives? It's like a Sancho in this game and Vulpix in Let's Go Eevee? Or can you get both in this game? I'm not entirely sure. Alright, this is our Pikachu trainer. You're having quite a marvelous adventure. That means I should increase the moves I can teach your Pokemon. So hey you, you want to teach a marvelous move to Pikachu? Yeah. Floaty Fall. That would, uh, flying type? Who it is. Let's get rid of Thunderbolt. We realistically don't need it because we have Zippy Zap. Pokemon Fluid Awakens a sleeping Pokemon. I had a Pokemon I would go Pokemon Row too. I believe this person. Now I am Madden Celadon. I am the one who can look into your future and see the encounters to come. I foresee the nature of those. Ten thousand dollars. No, I'm good. Uh, so I'm going to do it random right now. If you are like nuzlocking this game, or if you are going to try to like shiny hunt, you go to this person, you pay her ten thousand dollars. And you could choose, like, okay, I want, you know, if I want to shiny hunt for a modest, like, something, uh, you can just tell her you want her to foresee modest. And then all the Pokemon you'll catch for a while is going to be modest. So the shiny hunt won't work that way. Okay, let's fight this dude. A small pass between towns to heat Route 7 is nice, right? Okay, are you ready? Battle. Now let's play an ensemble called a battle. Go trainer Alpish. Alright, Alpish. Far fetched. I want a far fetched. Kind of at a disadvantage. Um, let's do Zippo. This side. Damn. Got a lot of damage. Remember. I get a better fire move. Not right now. Alright, this is just getting really buff. Alright, Thunderbolt this bitch. There's a crit, but it probably didn't matter. Whoa, would be tough. Yeah, let's keep that on. You're a higher level and mine is already hurt. I'm gonna dig. And I'm faster somehow. Oh, you're the facade master trainer. Or facade coach trainer. I see. Sing. That was a jerk move to do. Wake up, no one will kill you while you're sleeping. Nope, he's dead.
All right, Leviathan. Let's go ahead and send you back out. Um, just bite. Ah, sing again? Come on, dude. Golden is our strongest move because it's got a uh, stab, which is the uh, same type, whatever. It basically boosts it by like a mount. I found time to go. So there's nothing though. I want to burn. Give me a burn. That would help, that would help out a lot. Okay, come on Dan. I haven't used you in a minute. This trainer would take so long. Flybeam. Oh my god, singing again? It wouldn't matter if it wouldn't take four turns to wake up. Flybeam. I just wake up and get one move off. Come on, wake up and decide me. Damn it. This go trainer is destroying everything. Oh, Matarashi, come on, just hit one attack. Without falling asleep. That's all I need you to do. Wing attack. Coaches destroyed my team with facade and sing. Thank you for facade. We need Wigglytuff to have a sing. <laughs> and then we'll put facade on him. Did my Jigglypuff ever have sing? I feel like it should have came with scene. Okay, well, let's make our way back here. Grab this item. Got a nugget. It's more money, but we're good on money, right? Oh, we got 133,000. We're going with money. We're not having much long. I kind of need to save some. It's over here. I think the Mega Stone during this game. I think you can only use the starters at the beginning, or like, before you beat the Elite Four. So for our team, you'd only be able to use Charizardite. I'm not sure which one you get, like Y or X, or both. But then I think each other one costs like 30,000 after you beat the game. Alright, we got Play Rough. It's actually a really good move. As you can see from my notes, there's nothing I don't know. 
No, I don't want I don't want to listen to Link Trades. Who is this guy anyway? I know everything. Hmm. Damn case. Alright, let's get this fairy move on our Kimberly buff. Let's do... We don't need Thunderbolt, do we? Let's get rid of Thunderbolt. Our Gyarados has Thunderbolt and we have a Vileplume. So we don't really need to rely on Kimberly buff. Facade is 7100. Everyone can learn it though. Maybe we'll wait on that. I could give it to like Butterfree or something. I don't think that'd be as good as like Wiggly Duff. a polygraph here. Yep. And my pal, trusted pal polygraph. Well, all from Polyworld and I use a water stone on it. Oh, there's Brock. We'll do that next episode. Alright guys, I'm going to call it there. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hit the subscribe button down below. It helped me out a lot. Let me know what your favorite superstore is in Pokemon games. And I will see you all next time. Don't forget to game. Like a god. Peace.